Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to a brand new video. Today, we will be showing off this Galaxy Opal Donovan Mitchell. I know I've been a bit slack with content recently, but we have finally got this card from the challenges. I'm going to go through, I'll play some games online on Triple Threat Online, and I'll give you guys my review of the final card. We'll go jump into the main menu though, and have a look at this card stats. Alrighty guys, this is finally my video on Donovan Mitchell. I know this card came out a few days ago. I've been very, very busy with uni, so I've got a few videos coming out over the next few days. I'm also hoping that I'll have uh, David Robertson over the weekend as well, uh, but we shall see how we go. This card, now it has a 99 offense, a 97 defense, a 94 three ball, 94 mid, 98 driving dunk. So he gets a lot of driving dunks there. Ball handles 86, which is good. Steals a 94. He's got a 94 perimeter defense and a 94 steal, which is quite good for this card. 98 speed, very, very fast. Acceleration to 98 as well. Uh, and lateral quickness as well as 97. That's what you need on a 6-1. If you're running a 6-1, you need to make sure that they are fast. They can contest those shots. And have a look at these badges. 31 Hall of Fame badges. Catch and shoot feel as you guys can see them all here. It's got highlight film, which is good. Clamps on Hall of Fame, which we need. Intimidator, which is good. Posterizer, clearly. Pogo stick, which is very, very good. Circus 3s in Hall of Fame, which I like. Deep 3s, clearly that is also very good. This card's going to be very nice. I, I haven't seen any gameplay of it. I haven't looked at anything. Dead Eye, which is always good on a point guard. That's something that a lot of them need. And Volume Shooter as well, which is quite good. And he's also got the 24 gold. So we'll jump into a triple threat online game and see how well this Donovan Mitchell can go. Alrighty, here we go. Baron Davis is falling asleep in the Showtime dunk. There's the Aaron Gordon dunk from the dunk contest. Uh, goes for Donovan Mitchell. This card is very, very nice. The one thing I am noticing, though, he gets very, very tired very quickly. I didn't check what the stamina was, but I'm not sure if it's, like, absolutely amazing. I'm not sure if it's in the, in the high 90s like the rest of his... At, uh, the rest of the agility stats. As we go again here, Jared Allen in the paint. It doesn't matter. We're going to dunk all over him. This card is very, very athletic. Alrighty, here we go again. He's leaving me quite wide open there. The shot with Donovan, it's no good. I got no coverage there. Okay, a bit interesting. We do get Interceptor there. He does have it on gold. This guy's still playing off ball, which is a bit annoying. He did have Circus 3. So what I'll do, I'll wait for his stamina to replenish, and then I might try and get one of these deep threes to go. He's still playing off ball. But we'll try get one of these deep circus threes to go slightly early wide open and it still does not go So very interesting so far with Donovan. I still prefer driving with him He still gets those crazy contacts, but so far the shooting for me hasn't really been there All right, we'll try again here. We did have a crab there, but I wasn't gonna take it This guy's still playing off ball here. He's got Baron Davis playing uh, I, I want to try score all 21 you guys know that's what I like to do in these card reviews I like to try score all 21 so we might try burn this Baron Davis which we do get up on both of his teammates there and dunk it all over Bob Lanier. So a great finish there from Mr. Donovan Mitchell. Eight points so far. Haven't really liked the shooting. I'll get probably more used to his jump shot when I get more open with him. Uh, but so far, I'm really loving the driving dunk on this card. All right, he's out ball again here. Might call for a screen here from Buddy Heald and see if he wants to play on ball here. He's not. We'll go for the circus three there and we get it to go. So he has lock take that. I do have Mike Budenholzer. Uh, so he does give him a plus five on defense. So that is probably why he has this lock take. Majority of my point guards get lock take, which is very nice, especially playing like a 2-3 zone or something along those lines, because the defensive boost is quite good. So, so far, 11 points. I am liking the jump shot. I'm starting to like it a bit more. It's already better than like a Mark Price or something like that. And he can carry slide, which is very, very nice as well, uh, which is uh, something I don't think I've mentioned so far. So he is quite nice. We'll jump back in though, and we'll see how many points we can get with this Donovan Mitchell. All right, here we've got the ball again here. Got a bit of space. Go for another fading three. We don't get that one to go. A bit of unfortunate. There. This guy loves his Baron Davis. So I feel like he's going to go corner, which we read perfectly. The wide open break here. Don't get blocked. And we, of, of course, we get blocked. Of course, we get blocked. But we'll continue playing this defense here. We've got Baron Davis cold here. Oh, hang on. He's going back to the top. Bob Lanier is not a great shooter. Buddy healed in the lane. That's why I chose him. Going back to him. Uh oh. Chase down block here. No, unfortunately, we don't get it. Oh my goodness. There's, there's very lots of stops here. Lots of stops here. Hang on. Let's play some proper defense. Um, I still love this. This Donovan Mitchell with lock take is absolutely brilliant. Like, it's probably the last takeover I'd, I'd give to Donovan Mitchell. Well, maybe, like, post-scoring take. But I absolutely love this shot clock violation there. Great defense from Donovan Mitchell. We'll keep playing here, though. The stamina is something I'm worrying about, though. Like, he is losing it quite frequently. Uh, he's playing on-ball defense now. Very interesting. I don't know why he's chosen to do that all of a sudden. Uh, and I can't seem to break past him, even with uh, 
on ball defense. And there's the handles for Dave's Hall of Fame, which we like, and the 360 between the legs showtime dunk. So 13 to 3 here in this triple threat online game. All right, time to ISO this Baron Davis. He's, uh, he's back to off-balling again. Baron Davis is back to cold as well as we get another slam dunk there. 15 points now with Donovan Mitchell. Yeah, unfortunately, this guy had his meter on, which is a bit of a nuisance straight away. You can you can pretty much uh, nearly guarantee a win if you're coming up against someone with a meter. Uh, so that's my one recommendation to people watching. Please turn off your damn meter. Don't ever shoot this year with your meter on. It's absolutely useless. Uh, as we get it, oh, nearly good defense there. Oh, is he aim? No, I thought he was aiming then. Um, yeah, don't... Don't, don't use your meter this year, guys. I, I was I was genuinely thinking about making some sort of, like, I'm, I'm new to my team, but I was thinking about making some sort of, like, like literally three good tips to help you become a, a better my team player. He's sleeping on me. I can make that shot. Oh, no, I can't. I was thinking about making, like, three tips on how to become, like, a, a little bit better of a my team player because there is some things that I am seeing on stream, some things I'm seeing on videos, which is just unnecessary, and people can get so much better at the game if they take that out of their arsenal. Oh, my goodness. Oh my goodness, and we missed the shot there. Baron Davis was slipping and sliding all over the place then, and we don't get the shot to go. As I was saying before, it's usually an easy win. This guy is coming back, so I might need to start, you know, rim running again. Uh, another two-hand dunk there for Donovan Mitchell. 17 here, so two more baskets, and we'll be able to take the victory in this game. Uh, yeah, a little flashback to, uh, to uh, people with meters can't usually make shots. Um, but we'll keep going here. I don't want to lose this game. I could shoot it with Buddy Heald. Oh, I could have beaten this guy a long time ago, but I want to get all 21 here with this Donovan Mitchell. We get the step on him. We've got no stamina, but we still slam it home. All right, one stop here, and the game is ours. All righty, props to, uh, to early at Shooker about five minutes ago who said that you can beat anyone with a meter. Um, I definitely won that game, all right? It did, it, you can tell I won this game. Uh, we're going to go back to the menu, though, guys. <laughs> and uh, we'll have a gauge, though. We shot 9 and 19 with this card. Uh, he had, yeah, he had, he had his 19 points. So he shot as many sh uh, as many shots as he had points. Not the greatest. Two steals, though, which is always good. But we'll jump back into the, uh, into the menu, and I'll give you guys my final review on this Donovan Mitchell card. All right, guys, after embarrassing performance on Triple Threat Online, I've recovered, I've regained myself, and I can say this card is very, very nice. For a free Galaxy Opal, you need to play, like, maybe, like, two games max to get this card. If you play two Rookie Domination games, you can get this card pretty damn easy. So it's a free Galaxy Opal. I highly recommend adding him to your lineup, whether you're a uh, no-money-spent player, whether you're, uh, you know, he could play, he, he's probably not a comp player, but he is still a very, very good card to add to your lineup. The only thing is, I did want to check his stamina because I felt like I was losing a lot of stamina with him. Um, he's got a 92, uh, so it's not it's not incredibly high. It's still there, uh, but for some reason, I felt like I was losing a bit of stamina with him, though. But guys, that is my review on this Galaxy Opal Donovan Mitchell. Please leave me a opinion on this card down below. Have you guys got this card, and what do you think of him? And also, if you're new, consider subscribing. We're on the way to 20,000 subs, guys. The appreciation of, uh, of the support is so high right now. I absolutely love you guys so much. Uh, but guys, there will be multiple videos coming out over this weekend break and multiple streams. If you want to catch me streaming, head across to my Twitch channel, link in the description. And also check out my Twitter and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.